So you have a odd file format that you need to convert into something your computer can read for whatever reason. Here is the solution for you if you're using a Mac. There are multiple ways to do this, but VLC Player is a software application that can convert most any file and it's free and will always be free. So I'm going to show you how to use VLC Media Player to convert your files because let's give you one scenario. Let's say you're doing video editing and you want to use your version of We Wish You a Merry Christmas that's an AVI. What the crap is an AVI, says F Final Cut Pro. I don't know. Or you just want to watch it, but your QuickTime says, what the crap is this? Cannot open. All right, so we need to convert this weird file format into something the computer can read. So let's get a software that can do it. First, download VLC Media Player. Videoland.org is the official website. And so we are going to download VLC for Mac OS or Apple Silicon if you have a fancy new chip. And I've already done that. So it's downloaded on my computer. And you will get a DMG. Once you open that and download it, it will have this little thing on your desktop. And then you just, you know, drag and drop it to your applications. All right. So now you've got VLC in your applications. Now go to your applications. Here's my applications list. And look, here's VLC. Open up VLC. All right. Now, the VLC on Mac is different from the one on Windows. So if you're using Windows, it's not the same process and it doesn't look like this. That's why I'm making a Mac video. I already made the Windows video. You can check it out mm, somewhere in this. I just pointed somewhere where I pointed. All right, so what you do to convert your file formats is you open up VLC, you go to File, and you go down to Convert slash Stream or I guess you can press Command S. Just remember File Convert Stream. Now here's something you can open media if you like to use the searching through your files way, or you can just drag and drop. So I'm gonna drag and drop my Merry Christmas file over here. And there are a few bugs I had to work out to make this work properly. First, when I convert the file, I can't get sound out of it. So I'm going to have to convert it two times. The first time to get the video. So here I'm going to video. I can convert it to several different kinds of video. I'm going to convert it to MP4 because every program can read MP4. And we're going to save it as a file. Now, sometimes if you just go to audio codec and press keep original track, it will export the file with the audio. Sometimes this doesn't work. Let's see if it works this time. Okay, so we went to customize audio codec, keep original audio track. Now we're going to save this as a file in wherever. I'm going to do downloads. Okay, Merry Christmas. Save. Now click save. And sometimes if it's a big file, you'll see it. Yeah, you can see this uh, bar here moving. That means it's converting your file. If this doesn't start working automatically, just press play and it will start converting your file. All right, so we've converted the file. Let's open up a new finder window and it's in my downloads. So I'm gonna go to downloads and see, all right, can I hear audio? No, okay. The audio method didn't work this time. So I'm going to have to export it again with audio. I'm using this for video editing, so this is the best I can do. Uh, you have a free program called iMovie on your Mac that can edit the video together if you need to do it this way. Um, so we're going to export it as an audio file so we can have audio with our video. Um, I figured out none of the audio files worked. I don't know why because I'm not super computer literate. But audio CD worked. It made it a WAV file that my computer could read. So I'm going to export as audio CD, tell it to call it Merry Christmas Audio, and save the audio. All right, let's save it. So I know this is annoying, but if you're really desperate to get the video, you're gonna to have to do it this way and export two files and then mix them together. 
So now you can see I can hear the audio. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Okay. So if you're on a Mac, you have iMovie. This can mix these together for free. If you got lucky, you don't have to mix them together because VLC did it for you. But I can't figure out why it just it didn't work this time. It didn't work. So we're going to mix these together. This is our final step because my... I don't know if it's my computer's buggy or my... Uh, I'm just ignorant, but here's what I'm doing. Mostly you'll be doing this, I mean, a lot of people do this for edit, video editing purpose, like you need the MKV file converted to something that your video editor can read. Because um, if you just want to play the file, just use VLC player and it will play anything, like virtually anything. But if you need to work with it, edit it, mix it up. See, now I have this and I can Watch, we wish you a Merry Christmas with video. All right, so that is how to use VLC player with a, maybe it's because I have an old buggy computer. I have to do it this weird way. Maybe it's because uh, there's some settings I need to tweak. So I don't know about them. So I have to do it this way. Or maybe it's just because this file is all messed up. I don't know which, but I showed you how to solve the bugs if you have them. If your computer bugs out in a different way, just try different audio formats. Try MP3, try WAV format, that's audio CD. Try another audio format until it works. All right. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.